it's been a long time I wanted to make a recycle factor logo design in Inkscape and this time I finally found the technique indeed this technique is a bit long I hope in the future Inkscape supports smart fill features maybe not only me that is happy if this feature are present in Inkscape okay we see the result of this and here like this first step open your Inkscape and create a equilateral triangle object through extension menu and choose render and choose triangle and for set length A, A and B and C we fill uh, we fill with number 200 pixels for angle A, B and C we will fill with number 60 degrees and you can check with live preview like this and then click apply and close and for this triangle I will give a pink color and disable for stroke paint like this and the pink triangle I duplicate and move and in here I will give dynamic offset choose menu pad and choose dy dynamic offset and click this point like this and then change size of width before do that click key icon like this and change size of width with number 200 pixels like this and in here for opacity we fill with number 60 sorry 80 and duplicate again and move to the right with shift arrow right I mean right arrow three times one two three and arrow right three times again and next here we will close this part of letter V with small triangular triangular object with Bezier curve and and in here activate snap cos node and snap to pad intersection and we draw from this point handle to cos node handle to pad intersection handle to cos node and back to the starting point Disable for stroke pane and enable for fill, and then select three objects and choose pet menu and choose exclusion like this, and and then create rectangle object. cover this object like this 
in here I give a blue color and click icon I mean lower selection to bottom icon like this and select both objects and choose path and choose division and if it's for stroke pane and for stroke style we fill with the number one pixels so we can see which objects we want to remove click this object and remove with delete like this okay select this object this object here I give a dark green color like this and for blue object I give a light green color Sorry. Like this. And disable for stroke pain. And I union, I'm going to pet union like this and click pet union okay and and then move before do that we change the size of width with number 140 pixels like this and in here I give a blue color and move until sign Kusnode to Kusnode Like this Okay We draw a line object From left corner With Bezier curve From this point Handle to Kusnode And click press and hold down control and make sure the line segment of the start on the status bar show a uh, 30 degrees angle 0 15 and 30 degrees click and I duplicate this line object right click and duplicate and click flip selected object horizontally like this and move until assign Kusnode to but I mean Kusnode to Kusnode ok change for stroke style with the number 20 pixels and convert to pad with and with choose pad and choose stroke to pad and cut green color with black object pad difference pad difference and select green object and choose pad break apart remove bottom of this object delete 
and select all of object and rotate with transform and choose rotate tab and for angle you fill with number minus 120 degrees click apply make sure uncheck apply to each object separately and duplicate blue object duplicate and click rotate selection 90 degrees control clockwise and move and in here click edit pad and select these nodes like this and click insert new nodes into selected segments and for this blue object I give a purple color and and I will change the size with the number 44 width and 104 height like this and move until assign mm, sorry activate snap smooth nodes and move until a uh, cush node to smooth node like this and for the green object click edit pad and select these nodes and move to right with right arrow like this and then select with the purple object and choose pet union okay select green object all green object I mean like this and group with object menu and click group and then duplicate and rotate with object transform angle with angle minus 120 degrees click apply duplicate again and apply again like this and close and move this part this part object until assign smooth node to cos node move until a uh, cos node to cos node okay delete blue triangle object like this and in here I, I enable stroke pane for stroke pane change size of width with number 4 and I give a dark green color like this Finally, we can create re recyc recycle vector design in Inkscape. Okay, 
here is for this tutorial if you still do not understand please contact me via the comments below so and goodbye